Hi, Yarnabees. How are you doing today? Sorry, this scene is a little red. <laughs> if you're seeing it red, um, the sun was shining in here like crazy and I had to put something up on the window which just happened to be a red tablecloth. <laughs> so I'm looking like I'm glowing red right now, sorry. <laughs> um, but anyways, I got some yarny happy mail, or not happy mail, I got some yarny shipping in mail. <laughs> uh, the courier just left. And I also went to our local dollar store that just opened up because a friend of mine had said that there was some yarn in there and I thought I'd go, it was, it's a Dollarama. Thought I'd go check it out. Not very good, <laughs> of course. Um, but I did get something. And I also have uh, an, an FO to show you and a whip to show you. Almost done. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, yeah, so let's get started. First of all, I will show you my whip. Okay, I am using, whoops, because I got some comments on my video about the illusions, it's the Hayfield Illusions. Hayfield Illusions. Sorry, you're going to hear George talking in the background. His phone just rang. So, <clears throat> this is the Hayfield Illusions, and the shade is 0306. Um, I got this yarn from the wool wear shop. Oh, what wool wear shop? Oh, jeez. <laughs> the wool warehouse. It's in the UK. Absolutely love their yarn. Um... So, of course, I may, had to make a bag o' day cowl. I'm almost finished the cowl part. Oops. It's all tangled up here. I don't know how well this is going to show up with this lighting. But, um, it's... Oh, I don't know if you can... You can see that. You're probably not going to be able to see the shades as good as you would if it was better lighting in here. I'm thinking that I may end up having to film in here at night uh, and then maybe bring my lights in here and film that way because this light is not working. It's way too bright. I may end up having to get, the, get uh, some blinds put up in here. So, but anyways, so that's the cowl, and there is like color transitions, um, but like I said, you probably can't see it very good in this light, but, <clears throat> but anyway, uh, I used two balls at the same time to make it thicker, and I think it's turning out pretty good, so, so there's that. Oh, I'll put the um, the link for the wool warehouse down below. Okay. All right, and then I oh I do have another ball. Hang on. Okay, I used this is the yarn that Lisa sent me. I love this yarn, and the colorway is called Fruit Salad. Uh, says 444. Uh, this is a 100% acrylic. It's a 5 weight, which I don't believe it is. It looks more like a 4. There's 230 meters, 252 yards. Uh, oh, it is a 4. There it is. Yeah, so it's 4 weight, but it's sprinkles. Every time I see, <coughs> excuse me, every time I see this yarn, I think of a cake. Way back when. I just love it. So I haven't got my tags on this yet, but I made, I did a beanie hat. I don't know if you can see, can you see that? 
Let's see if I can put it on. <laughs> there we go. So that's the hat. And then I made the cowl to go with it. And this is again the bag of day. There we go. Ooh. So there's the cowl. I think it's cute. And it's got all the little spark little um little colory bits in it. Now I was planning on doing the dark um top to the cowl and the tassels. But believe it or not, with all of these colors, I could not find a color to match in my stash. I couldn't believe it. <laughs> I thought I had like every color in the rainbow, but apparently not. So, but that's okay because I really like the way this turned out. All right, now for my dollar store find, I found Hometown USA. Uh, it there is 142 grams, 81 yards, 74 meters. It's 100 percent acrylic, and it's a bulky six. And this is a sage. Where's the color? Do 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 do. What's the colorway? Saint Louis sage. It's beautiful it's it's I really like this color it's very nice there was a dark green as well which I didn't grab I should have but I didn't uh, I've never I don't think I've ever had a yarn in this color before so I'm gonna make a cowl and a hat with this so that's exciting okay I have been waiting almost three weeks for this package. I am not impressed. Lovecraft. This is finally my ribbon yarn for the Chronically Crochet um, ribbon scarf. I can't believe how long it took these guys. How come we can get um, yarn from Turkey in a couple of days and it takes almost three weeks for Lovecraft to send us something. I, I couldn't believe it. I am so not impressed. And of course it's probably the only place that we're going to be able to find this yarn. Oh, not happy. Oh, oh gee. Okay. Oh wow, this is pretty. <laughs> Man, I wish that the lighting was better in here. Oh wow. Okay, let's hope and pray that this will actually um, show up. Okay, this is, let me put my eyeballs on. Um, oh, it's just got numbers for colors. It's color 16, but it's a purple and black. Whoop. Let's try that. You see it looks pink in here, but it's it's like a um, like a, a lavender color. Man, I really wish that it showed up better. It's really pretty. So I got that and then I got a white and gold. Isn't that gorgeous? And it I'll tell you something, it looks way better in person. It's it doesn't give it justice um, on this camera. This is called Tinsel Town Yarn, uh, Tinsel Town Ribbon Yarn. And this color is 21. I'll leave the link down below for Lovecraft and for the the page. 
Okay, now this is a brown gold mix, a brown gold beige mix. I figured because Christmas is coming that these would be really good Christmassy colors. But look at the sparkle on that. Oh my goodness. So pretty. This color is number nine. Okay, ooh. This is the red and black. It's actually a bit darker than it's, come on, focus, focus. It's uh, a bit darker than it's showing up. So pretty. <clears throat> this one, oh, this is beautiful. This one is a blue, it's like a um, it's not teal. It's like, oh, what is that color? It's, it's a certain blue. And I can't, for the life of me, it's like a dusty blue, kind of. The color is number 13. Oh, isn't that beautiful? Oh, it's so pretty. And I got two bags here, but that's all the same color as I just showed. And then this is I lied. This one's not purple. This one is pink. It's a pink and reddy color. This one is the purple. Oops. Come on, focus. Oh, look at that lusciousness. Oh, that's showing true to color. And this color is 15. So that's all the colors that I got. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, I got six colors. So I am so excited to finally be able to do my scarves in time for my next craft fair. Finally. And they're big craft fairs. They're two-day craft fairs. And we've got two going at the same time. So George is going to be in one location for a day and I'm going to be in the other location for a day and then we'll be together uh, on it's the sat the, um, it goes on the Friday Saturday and Sunday so on the Friday and Saturday Friday I'll be with him at uh, a school and then he'll be at that school the next day by himself whereas I will be oh all the way over at an exhibition and I will be there for Saturday and Sunday. So he will finish his on Saturday and then come see me on Sunday. <laughs> so it's gonna be craziness. Um, so yeah, so I'm finally gonna get these done. Yay! I think I got three of each color. So I'm excited, finally. But I'm still not impressed with how long it took. I don't know if that was just um, a mess up or if it actually takes that long. You know, I mean, if I thought it was going to take that long, I would have probably just ordered from China because it would have taken as long, right? Three, four, four weeks coming from China. Like, seriously, that's not good. So, I comment down below and tell me if you've had that experience with Lovecraft because this is my first time ordering from them and uh, wasn't a good experience. So... But anyways, uh, I will probably order from them again just because, <laughs> but I'll have to see, maybe look and see if they have um, like an expedited shipping or something like that. So, cause I know that come Christmas, they're not, you're not going to be able to get it any faster. So, <clears throat> but anyways, that's all I have to show you today. Uh, so thanks for joining me. Do the likes and the comments down below and the don't forget the notification bell because everybody seems to be having a problem with that. 
um, they're not getting their notifications of videos that are coming up and I don't know how to fix that so just keep coming checking back okay so I'll talk to you guys later love you bye